There were remarkable scenes in Aylesbury this week when a young cat got itself stuck at the top of a 70-foot tree for nearly 24 hours, where it was repeatedly attacked by crows before being rescued by firefighters. The seven-month-old black-and-white cat, somewhat ironically named Holly, got stuck in a large tree off Rutherford Road near Stoke Mandeville Hospital at around 4pm on Monday. The cat gradually made her way right to the top of the tree and went without food or water for nearly 24 hours as the sun beamed down at temperatures reaching 25 degrees Celsius. And to make matters worse for Holly and her distressed owners, some large crows took offence to the moggy's presence in the branches and repeatedly attacked her. Jason Thompson, the boyfriend of the cat's owner, Lisa Govier, spoke to BHTV about the bizarre incident. Well, I mean, it was, it was fairly straightforward last night. Um, the, uh, the cat went up the tree, named Holly. Um, it's only a little kitten, seven months old. Um, she was about halfway up, wouldn't come down, so we tried to coax her down, um, but she wouldn't come. Uh, obviously, my girlfriend, who owns the cat, is, uh, is very distressed about it, and um, obviously didn't sleep very much last night. But now, uh, the crows seem to have arrived, and there's a couple of crows just taunting her, trying to peck her, and uh, yeah, she looks very distressed up there. She's not meowing anymore, and uh, we're all really concerned. All the neighbours have come out because obviously they can hear all the commotion with the crows. Um, we put God knows how many calls into the RSPCA. Still them coming back with the same thing. Um, it's not high priority. Um, the 24 hours isn't up. Um, and it's a bit sad really, after all the good things you hear about the RSPCA. Um, you know, I mean, we wouldn't be calling unless it was actually necessary. And I mean, the tree's, what, 70, 80 foot high? And she's at the top and she's not, she's not moving. We don't know what to do. It's a baking hot day. It's a black kitten. She's scared. So, yeah, so we're stuck really. Um, we're trying all sorts of things, but just to try to scare the crows off. Um, but that doesn't seem to be working. Shortly after the interview, some nearby workmen offered a helping hand with a cherry picker. But it wasn't tall enough to reach the pet, who was still under intermittent attack from the crows. However, with the cat growing visibly weaker, owner, Lisa, put in an emotional plea directly to Owsbury Fire Station, and a sympathetic officer attended to assess the situation before calling in the turntable ladder from High Wycham to rescue the feline. The RSPCA eventually arrived at the scene and checked Holly over before handing her to the relieved couple. This is Damien Lucas for BHTV.